Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I just wanted to do a really quick video on my Louis Vuitton Pouchette Matisse. This bag is 9.8 inches by 7.5 inches and it is three and a half inches in width. It has an adjustable strap. It has a top handle with the Vachetta leather and it has three pockets with microfiber lining on the inside. So, let's take a look at the bag. There's a piece of the Vachetta leather right up on top, and then it has one of these trunk style clasps. The bag actually has an envelope looking front to it, and it can be worn using this top handle. Opening the bag, one of these is like one of them moves and one of them is stationary, so you can like pinch them together, which reveals the inside of the bag. There's three pockets on the inside, like I just stated. Let me just show you guys. This pocket back here, which is a very slender pocket. And then there's the center pocket. I don't know if you guys can see the inside. And this is the biggest part of the bag. And then we have the front pocket, which I actually have my full-size Emily wallet in the front pocket. And that's just to help. It really helps if you have something in there so that it closes when you open it up. I'll take my wallet out and you don't have something in there, the bag is just so much harder to close. You really have to push it in, and since this is like an accordion style bag, it just helps if you have something that's in there. Looking at the back of the bag, there is a zipper pocket. Older styles, which the bag's not that old, but when they first came out, they had a leather pull tab, and they have since changed it to the gold hardware. That reads Louis Vuitton. I know sometimes people question, like, why are the LVs upside down? And it is because it is one piece of canvas. So when you're looking at it flat out, it should be upside down in the back. If you're looking for the date code on this bag, the date code is in this back pocket. Let's see. It's really hard to get to, I think. Right there is the leather with the date code. And then we'll go ahead and look at the sides of the bag, which have the small piece of the shadow leather and the gold hardware that we believe a ton. Everything as always, it's perfectly lined up. And it does have a removable strap, so if you didn't want to wear this with a strap, you can go ahead and take it off, and like I said at the beginning, you could just wear it with the top handle. I really like this bag. I bought it with the intent of wearing it as a crossbody, because I do like to be hands-free, having two small children. I just thought that that would be more ideal to have the crossbody, but I do find myself wearing this just as a shoulder strap. I'm gonna take the strap off and look at just the strap for a minute. 
So this strap can be purchased separately on Louis Vuitton for a couple hundred dollars, I believe. But this comes with the bag. It says Louis Vuitton on there. Everything is perfectly lined up. This strap is so sturdy too. I would never think that I would have any issues with this strap. Getting to the adjustable part, there are seven holes. I'm 5'2", and I wear it on the third hole. And like I said, I wear it as a crossbody. Going back to the gold hardware, it says Louis Vuitton again. I'm sure you could probably put the strap on other bags if you had them. This is my first bag, so I really like the versatility of the bag. Like I said, you could wear it as a crossbody, as a shoulder strap or just as, it kind of looks like a small briefcase. I was so surprised with the amount of stuff that this held. And I just think that this is a very beautiful piece. I think that it is fitting if I am running to the grocery store and I put it on as a crossbody, or if I'm going out to dinner and I wanna wear it as a shoulder strap bag. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick review and overview of my Louis Vuitton Pouchette Matisse and let me know in the comments below what your favorite piece is. If you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe and let me know if you guys like this style of review so that I can do more for you. Thank you.